What is up guys? It's Mike Tamemo here and welcome to my YouTube channel and most of all welcome to my Gothic 3 playthrough, the playthrough of the Hushishin aka Beliar. And this is episode ooh, 11 part 3 I suppose. Um where we can finish at least try to finish Ben Salas. Unlike the last video, I'm not going to blabber that much um, when it comes to off-topic, you know, but um, I'm going to get this done ASAP. So, uh, without further ado, guys, let's begin. Now uh, there will be quite some undead to uh, deal with, but I do have to at least try to make sure that uh, I'm not quite sure what the guy's name exactly is, but I think it was something in the direction of M Miguel, which is uh, one of the NPCs hidden in uh, one of the tunnels. But uh, I'm gonna try to keep him alive because of the fact that he's quest related at least to towards Ben Sala reputation. It's not a must, but uh, I prefer to keep him alive than dead. It's not gonna be easy though, because there will be a whole lot of undead.
like I said, I should be careful. Because if he dies, that quest automatically fails. Now as long as you're out of his uh, range, you know, when it comes to, if he isn't on the screen, then his HP will automatically be fully restored. So make use of that effort if you want to keep him alive. I'm gonna save relatively often because that's another way to get his HP back to max. So as soon as he dies I reload. Because I want to keep him alive. How is that arrow going right through him? See? Right through him. Again, right through him. can ride through them. You gotta love this game's bugginess sometimes.
sometimes I just don't get this game, you know. It's sometimes I plainly miss, like the last shot. Sometimes I hit, I'm pretty sure I hit, and then it goes right through him. Again, go right through them. Obviously miss. See, go right through him when I want to shoot on his head. Stomach goes right through him. They never do. Leaving us in peace, that is. showed him really you're gonna attack my skeleton I'll make sure that shoot the skeleton win I'm gonna knock him down, otherwise he's most likely gonna die. Come on, hit him. No one will miss you. Good job. Stay here. And do not move. Alright, so let's get the supplies from the tunnel. Be right back, Miguel.
well, interesting. I thought there would be at least a couple more, but uh, apparently I've got them all, which is good, you know. Alright, so this area is done. But I got all the cudgels. Because the arrows alone was a certainly expensive feat. And Miguel. Come on, Miguel. What are you doing here? What do you think? I'm hiding. It's terrible. They, they're all dead, but, but they aren't. They died. But they got up again, right before my eyes. Yeah, curse those undead. I beg you, take me away from here. Do you know anything about crates of steel? Before the undead came, there were some raiders in the tunnel. They dragged off a couple of chests, but I was able to save one. Here, you take it. Where do you want to go? Back to Ben Sala. Enzo will need my help, if he's still alive. Fine. I'll take you to Enzo. Thank you. Nah, no problem, man. I'll take you out of here. Good. Ayo, let's -a go. Now, the only thing that I still have to do is uh, killing the nomads. I've got the steel that you wanted. Thank you. This is a good omen. Things are picking up again. Here, take this as a token of my gratitude. I brought you somebody. Miguel, my loyal servant. Excellent. Thank you. And please forgive my initial mistrust, father of righteousness. You helped me a lot. I know. Show me your goods. I'm a man that helps quite a bit. I'm going to relax a little. You do that. You must have things of your own to take care of. What about the temple? That's where the disaster started. That's where the source of evil is. But nobody in their right mind would dare go in there. If we ever want peace and quiet here, we must attack the temple as well. You've got a point. Right. You won't have to enter the temple by yourself. But first, the surroundings must be safe. The tunnels are free once again. Great. We owe you our gratitude, Father of Bravery. Your men are dead. I have set them free. Damn that undead spawn. Does this madness never end?
Would you teach me how to fight? I want to be a stronger swordsman. No problem. A strong sword fighter doesn't just whack at his opponent. He is aware of his opponent's position. Swing with your body, not just your arm. Remember that and use it. Then you'll live longer. You don't have the necessary experience. Alright, I need one more level. Because I'm now about 14, I think, that I have 14 learning points. 13. What about the temple now? This is a dangerous venture. If anyone can pull it off, you can. Go see Dalak. He will accompany you. I bet he does. God bless you, my friend. I don't have the ingredients for that. A bit of uh, healing potion supply problem. Well, let me clear the nomads and then we're gonna enter. I think it's gonna be smarter if I'm gonna do the temple in part 4. Now, I don't want to do a part 4, but uh, the temple is gonna cost me quite a bit of time, ammunition, potions, as well as a, a lot of arrows. So I think it's going to be smarter to do the uh, temple on part 4, but that remains to be seen. It remains... Depends on how quickly I can go to the little nomad cave over there. But since I still have to level quite a bit, I'm going to kill every enemy along the way. Well, those that I can handle, that is. By using smart tactics. The beasts just don't learn. They never do. Uh, I am uh, the son of combat. Zombies and mummies for that matter. Ah, so close yet so far. So let's quickly go to the cave. It's gonna be guarded by a couple of nomads, but uh, I will have a little help. It's over there, you can already see it in the distance. So the next time I level, I can finally go do a wielded sword. Yeah, it's about time, goddammit. it. 
did I? No. Whoa, why the lag? Kick his ass, skeleton. Stop right. I think it's a smart move to save right here, but... Karma is a bitch. Beauty of a servant of Belear. It never stops supporting. Yep, before I gotta go to the temple, I really need to resupply on some of my potions. Or keep my distance. Job, skeleton. Uh, yep, I really need some uh, healing supplies badly, especially versus those are. Uh, Undead Madoshis, I hate those.
stop right there. The beasts just won't leave us in peace. My skeleton may be a miserable beast, but it's a never-ending support. Well, unless my mana ends up. But the temple is definitely going to be part 4. So close to death, a bit too close to comfort. Well done skeleton. Now when it comes to gold, I don't really have the gold to buy many, many potions, but uh, I can certainly buy a few. And the gods know, especially Baliar, that I'm gonna use, I'm gonna need it. You have served me well, skeleton. Go, Go back. back now. May you rest in peace in the realm of Baliar.
These should be all of your crates. You are truly a hero. Thank you very much. Now we can get down to business. Show me your goods. You do have a hammer, which I need for a quest in Vanguard Capital. But you do not have potions, which I need more. I need 5 saws, 10 hammers, and 21 pickaxes. Well, 20 and 1 for myself. So, 21. Well, I got some gold. Let's sleep until next morning for some free mana and HP. And then we're gonna, uh, per gonna end this part. And uh, in the next part, I will quickly go to the cities to find mages of any kind to buy potions mainly healing potions but uh for now we are done so uh thank you guys f for watching and if you like what you see subscribe to my channel and hit the like hit the notification bell and if you want to see a gothic series hardcore run smash that like button because the gods know old and new that i can definitely use the motivation and um i hope to see you guys in the last part and uh, the last part truly where we're gonna go to the temple after purchasing some healing potions and perhaps some mana potions but that remains to be seen so yeah i want to thank you guys for watching and i hope to see you guys in part four which is most definitely gonna be the last part of Ben Sala. So yeah, thank you guys for watching and I hope to see you guys next time.